All right, this is what it is, man. It's your homeboy, Dougie D. Hush DVD. You know what I'm talking about? We in the motherfucking building right now with my niggas. You know what I'm talking about? Thug motherfucking mafia, man. What it is, bro. We got the, you know what I'm saying? Let me get a, let me get a little bit of introduction out of y'all fellas. Let everybody know who everybody is and what's going on. Okay. Hey, I'm Scooper Started Thug Mafia and Street Boss. You know what I'm saying? We get it in. I'm D Man and Max Jurious, Thug Mafia representative, worldwide lyricist. Y'all just stay tuned. I might fly over your house in a jet. I'm AJ, the original. Y'all already know TMF, Thug Mafia, Chain Game, man. I'm in here, man. Stack Game proper. It's coming soon, man. Holla at me. Hey, what it is? It's your boy, Duke Della, your number one TMI boy slash Thug Mafia. You know, I'm playing Boy the Six Man, aka T Castle. You know what I'm saying? Thug Mafia, Win Squad, Nappy Boy, all day. Already, you know what I'm saying? That's the introduction of these bars right here. But I'm kind of uh, noticing that, man. We're missing one of the bars, man. Yeah, young center star, huh? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So I already know y'all gonna hold it down and represent for that cat, man. But look here, man. What the people need to know, man, you know what I'm saying? On the Hush DVD, man, I want to get it live right now, man. You know what I'm saying? We heard some of the stuff that y'all got coming out. But, like, you hear the name Thug Mafia, you know what I'm saying? You know, everybody claiming they thugs in these streets, you know what I'm saying? Niggas talking about this, that, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Can you, like, give us some insight on, like, what the Thug Mafia, the whole genre of what it really just stand for and what it is? Thug Mafia stand for a bunch of street niggas holding down different sides of the world and Houston that's a family. All, anytime, you know, any, all Mafia always mean family. And, you know, Thug is, you know, Thug is like, um, you know, yeah, we was born in this, not sworn in it. So we we was born like this. So you know, everybody claimed to be thugs and this and that and that and this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, talking about thugs. Yeah, see, yeah, yeah, see, that ain't what it is. We been we been about this. And you know, my nigga Dougie D, he know what it is. You know, we been 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 about this. So it, it's just it's just a bunch of hood niggas, you know, just coming together, you know, on some real. Thug shit, yeah, yeah. and that's a family ties type shit. Making music, big business, and street money. That's Thug Mafia. You know what I'm saying? And it's all over the world. We got a bunch of chapters. Thug Mafia is not just H Town. It's a bunch of chapters. And right now, with with the music and the way everything is, you know, everybody want to be a boss. Uh, you got everybody talking about how much dope they didn't cooked up and sold and this, that, or whatnot. And I ain't gonna even lie. Some of these niggas lying. They they brother, you know what I'm saying? They brothers was doing that. Or, they Paw Paw or, or, or Daddy or someone was doing that. And you know, with that in mind, like, considering that a fact niggas is thug niggas out here, you know what I'm saying? Like, on the positive side of it, what, do, what, what you can give to the young nigga out there, you know what I'm saying, that's, 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 that's coming from the same place that we coming from though, you feel me? What we can give to the youth is, you know, we done been there, we done done this, we done done what y'all thinking is cool to do. So we gonna give y'all insight on what it is, how to, the trouble that come behind doing what we do. And we gonna let y'all know, and we gonna let y'all know it ain't cool, but if you can find a way out like we trying to find a way out, you know, and do something positive with your life, and do something positive with yourself, you can be a way better person than trying to follow in somebody's footsteps because they live in that street life. That street life shit ain't cool. All of us sitting right here trying to duck that street life and get away from it. So we doing this. So that's what we can give the youth and give somebody on insight because we done lived it. You know, somebody that ain't lived it can't tell me nothing about it. The principal couldn't tell me nothing. But that counselor from the penitentiary, I used to listen to him when he used to tell me, man, you need to stop doing what you're doing because he didn't been through what I'm going through. So, you know, that's what we can do. We done all been through it and we done lived that life. So now we got a story to tell the youth and let them know that this ain't the thing to do. Streets ain't the thing to do. Get your education and do your thing. To give y'all an example about how it is, you know, you get caught in situations and it's not always good. Me and my bro right here, the crew, all of them had situations. But at the present time, we got things going on and me and him had to coach each other through because we got to do stuff like this federal. I got to take this with me everywhere I go to get a pass. My dudes, they blessed us getting all these good road trips and we got to come up with reason to our POs and, and hope that they gonna let us go, you know what I'm saying, on something. So all that ain't cool, you know what I'm saying? If you got a situation, you know what I'm saying, running with it, you know what I'm saying? It's about networking, you know what I'm saying? That's the basic thing you need to be doing, networking, bro. You know, all that in the street, that's cool. I ain't knocking you because, you know, we all had our taste of it, you know what I'm saying? But we got a chance and an opportunity for something else to come out of this, you feel what I'm saying? So that's how we rocking with this, you know? But it's official, what we talk about, you can look us up, you know, Google, whatever, you know, it's, it ain't hard. We keep God first, you know, we wake up every morning, you know, 
you gotta wake when you wake up every morning you gotta open your eyes as soon as you get conscientious enough to think clearly you gotta actually thank god you know you gotta talk to god before you talk to people you know keep god first you know and everything else lined up right you know because we're gonna sin we deep in the flesh you know we're gonna be tempted but really you gotta stay loyal to your family that's why we call ourselves thug mafia because we all came we all played a part in the streets and growing up in the streets in a certain kind of manner. Somebody hustled, somebody jacked, somebody fought, somebody did this, somebody prostituted. It was, it's always something that was connected with the streets. So because we thugs and we fam and we happen to be we family, but we happen to be thugs. So basically keep keep loyalty amongst your people. You know, feed your people and uplift your people. And that way good love and good blood to circulate you know what i'm saying and that's that's what that's that's basically what i can say to people you got to stick you got to treat your people right